The Kentucky State Fair is still planning for a full scale event despite concerns about the Delta variant. But as WDRB's Lauren Smith tells us, if you're planning to go to the fair, take a mask. The Expo Center is state property and must comply with the governor's mask mandate for state buildings. As long as you're outside, it's OK. But when you walk indoors, you must pull up the face covering. Travis Scanlon and his company Affordable Street Rods from Kansas setting up for this weekend's National Street Rod Show at the Expo Center. It is one of the biggest events of the year. We, we shut down our home warehouse for a week to be here. But Scanlon says he was not aware that he's now supposed to be wearing a mask. I've got it ready here if I had to put it on. So yeah, I just uh, hadn't heard it from them yet. Kentucky Venues President David Beck says they're still trying to get the word out to everyone. Making sure they understand that this is a state property and that is a state requirement for all state office buildings. So we had to communicate that. The signs have already been posted and unless something changes, the indoor mask requirement will be in effect for the state fair, which opens August 19th. We can have a good state fair and still require masks. But Beck says he is concerned that the mandate will affect attendance. Sure, any kind of compliance can always affect participation, and we recognize that. But I think the key to that is people knowing well in advance. Scanlon says that's his concern, that the mask requirement will cause some to stay outdoors. That will keep them from coming inside this building for sure and that actually could affect our sales. So we're a little worried about that. But Scanlon says he will comply with the rules. We'll, we'll do whatever is required of us. Beck hoping others have the same attitude because he has no authority to enforce the mandate. Our people aren't uh, trained and empowered to do that at this point in time. The rules are posted here at the doors, at the gates, and on the Kentucky State Fair website. And Beck says plans are in the works to offer vaccines at the State Fair. At the Expo Center, Lawrence Smith, WDRB News.